Hello I am Henry the Genius and today I will be teaching you all about non-renewable and renewable energy sources. Firstly let's begin with defining non-renewable energy sources. Non-renewable energy sources are fossil fuels that are found underneath the earth. Fossil fuels are made from the decayed remains of plants and animals which become buried under the earth. Over millions and millions of years they were subjected to pressure and heat by earth movements and chemically changed into oil, natural gas, and coal. Non-renewable energy sources are those that cannot be replaced as they are used and we are using our stores of fossil fuels very quickly. In Canada 70% of the energy we use comes from fossil fuels and worldwide 85% of the energy used is obtained from fossil fuels. We should look for alternatives to fossil fuels because the main element in oil, gas, and coal is carbon. The chemical reaction which takes place when we burn fossil fuels releases carbon compounds such as carbon dioxide and carbon monoxide into the air. Carbon dioxide is one of the greenhouse gases which scientists believe is contributing to the climate change on Earth. So now to renewable energy sources. Renewable energy sources are those which do not diminish over time or can be replaced in a short amount of time. Some renewable energy do emit carbon dioxide and other greenhouse gases but they emit much less than fossil fuels do. Biomass energy is the energy source first used by humans. It includes things like wood, animal waste and seaweed. Biomass is essentially an organic matter that can be used to generate energy. There are four main groups of biomass energy sources. Firstly wood, wood, wood chips and waste products from the lumber industry can be burned or used to produce electricity. Solid waste. In many parts of the world animal waste is what people use to cook their food and to warm their homes. Garbage, decaying garbage produces methane gas which can be used for heating or producing electricity. Plants, plants like corn and wheat are full of sugars and starches which can be fermented to produce ethanol. Ethanol can be mixed with gasoline to make cleaner burning fuels for cars. There is also geothermal energy which is heat energy obtained from below the Earth's surface and solar energy which is radiation energy produced by the sun. We can harness solar energy by using photovoltaic cells which transform solar energy into electricity. Water energy, we get energy from water by harnessing the power of its movement. The movement of rivers, waves and tides can all be used to generate electricity. And last is wind energy mecha like water the power of the wind can be used to produce electricity. Now you are probably wondering what is electricity is it a renewable source of energy or non-renewable well it is non it is a secondary source of energy because it can only be generated through the transformation of other energy sources. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you learned a lot and enjoyed this movie.